Ah, a gente vai tirar uma foto ali na Times Square, né? Na frente do telão ali. Pô, eu gosto, bem movimentado, né? É, pô, muitas pessoas, a gente sabe, pessoas de todo lugar aqui. E aí, pô, dá um, dá um rolê aqui, legal. Tem essa, essa rua aqui famosa, né? Os telões, pô, famoso. Só alegria. Chama. Essa energia boa, né? Essa nova oportunidade, não posso desperdiçar, dá o meu melhor e... Yo, Embedded, was good! Valeu! Was good, Embedded, we out here! Que nem na outra luta, depois vim aqui com o cinturão, só comemorar, só alegria. Bom, o treino foi muito bom. É, tô forte, tô me sentindo forte, tanto na parte de chão quanto na parte de trocação. Eu tô me sentindo como se fosse na minha primeira luta, pronta para essa luta. É, provavelmente eu nunca lutei com alguém com um jiu-jitsu tão bom quanto o da Mackenzie, né? Mas é, eu, eu acho que foi um casamento muito bom. Eu tenho uma trocação muito boa, ela vem evoluindo na trocação. Eu acho que no começo da luta ela vai querer trocar comigo e depois ela vai ir pro, pro jiu-jitsu, que é a arma forte dela. Mas eu tô pronta para isso também. Estar aqui em Nova York, no Madison Square Garden, que é um das arenas que todo mundo quer lutar, né? Onde tem muito fã, a galera que ama o MMA. Então, assim, vai ser muito emocionante, vai ser muito emocionante. Eu acho que é mais uma, uma, uma coisa que eu vou riscar da minha lista, né? E, e esse aí, vamos fazer história, vamos... Pronta para esse casamento dessa luta e pronta para dar um show no sábado. Has fighting here in New York in Madison Square Garden, was that a goal for you at all coming up? Yeah, I definitely like, this is like the most famous arena in the world, you know, so that was always a goal of mine to fight here. And, and after my last fight, I asked for a former champion, so it's kind of like, <laughs> they kind of gave me everything, so now I'd, I have no excuses, I need to do good. <laughs> Two of her last three losses have come by submission, I would imagine that you like that, this matchup even more, considering your skill set. Yeah, for sure. I mean, all my fights, everyone knows that it's, the easier route for me is to the ground, the hard part is to get to the ground. How do you see this fight playing out in your mind? Um, I see a finish for me. Mackenzie, we are taking you into the Drew Barrymore room. Yay. It's fitting, right? <laughs> totally. I always like that. I was like a, consider myself like a Charlie's Angel, you know? <laughs> and I always be yeah, because I have like two of my friends. One is like a Japanese with dark hair. And my other one's blonde, you know, so she was always like the Cameron Diaz, and I was always the Drew Barrymore. <laughs> so, bye, bye, bye. What's up, brother? Hey, great. How you feeling? Great. Great. You good? Yeah. So Alex Pereira is very good on the feet, as we know, yeah. but the grappling, maybe not the best. Yeah. Is that a part of the plan? Uh, for me, is... Uh... Just grab one of these legs. Oh, oh, man. No, he's no. on fire. <laughs> <laughs> you got me on the chin. <laughs> Give me a little uppercut. <laughs> Man, you have to be older than Pre prepared. You got me. After that year from the injury, that was the way to improve myself, to connect all these parts, like wrestling, grappling, ground and pound, and stand up. Mm -hmm. To not just make a difference between, between that. Yeah. yeah. That's why I think I'm more complex fighter and I can attack Alex in every part of that. When I am in the octagon, my movement, my legs, is prepared to do everything. Yeah. Jump to... Oh no, whatever, I know. Whatever. I did that, what, what, you went look straight what, away what, again. What, what, whatever. What happens if I do that? Yeah. <laughs> Jeez, no, but you're ready. You're ready, you're fast. How's it going, Yuri? Hey, great. How are you? Hey, great. Hey, man, I like your hair. Oh, oh yeah. <laughs> yeah, you need to you be a bigger antenna, yeah. yeah. <laughs> it's growing. Great. <laughs> What's up, Sergey? What's up? Right, good luck this week. Good Thanks luck. so much. It's going to be a great Thanks fight. so much. Sergey, you're a very big man, but you, you've always got a smile on your face. I should go see. 
Ну, когда будет бой, тогда будем настраиваться. Сейчас мы перед боем. Ты знаешь, я всегда говорю, я готовился на все пять раундов. Нокаут такая штука, которую невозможно запланировать. Она приходит неожиданно. Мы посмотрим. Я рассказывал, что приходилось драться, потому что ну, мы росли в маленьком таком поселке, где, скажем так, свое мужское нужно было отстаивать кулаками. Если ты слабый, то ты не сможешь там пройти куда-то, сходить нормально. Ты должны знать, что ты можешь за себя постоять. I guess I just wanted to start with what you said about your personal improvements in terms of knowing your own body since the injury. Mm -hmm. If you could just expand upon that. You know when everything's going good, it's hard to like start making changes in it. Yep. I need, I, I wasn't really training with many heavyweights and I knew that I needed to. When I got the knee injury, I was like, I need to either go all, all in on this stuff or I need to stop. So yeah. obviously decided to go all in. From the moment you started, there was like, oh, this English kid, Tom Aspinall, can be really, really good. Yeah. How early did you recognize that, man, these people rec think that I'm going to be this mm. thing? I don't know. Um, I didn't believe it myself, to be honest, at first. I wasn't sure. I always knew that was good. But I didn't know if I could do it under the pressure and, and the bright lights of like being in the UFC. But as soon as I start beating like former champions and ranked guys, I was like, oh, shit, I am pretty good. You know I mean? <laughs> <laughs> no, it's the truth, dude. Like, you're in there like, this is awesome. Yeah. Yeah, but you know, like when I fight on Saturday, I'm just going to be thinking about Pavlovich and what I got to do in that fight and nothing else. Like, all, everything else is irrelevant. Bye, see you guys. See you today. Have a good day. You too. Always special to be here in New York City. Thank you all very much for being here. All right, who has the first question? For Alex, please. Uh, you've been a champion before, but what would this victory mean for you? Well, for me, it's very special. But I think it's for the work that I've done since when I came to the organization. Estou tendo a oportunidade novamente aí de estar disputando e levando mais um cinturão em outra categoria. Yuri, do you wish maybe you hadn't vacated the title and that you'd have kept it this time, or do you feel like it was the right choice? It was the right choice because show must go on. The division must throw. Let the see who's the best guy now here and this guy I want to face. Tom, yesterday you said that Sergey was probably the scariest man in MMA. So I'm just wondering, first impression seeing him on a stage here. Pretty scared. Scary guy, mate. Yeah, definitely an intimidating guy. But that being said, fear is something that I have a really good relationship with. DC actually told me today about, what, what was it, a honey badger? Yeah, honey badgers are the league leaders in fear, so they're pretty dangerous in combat. That's me. I'm the honey badger moving forward, so I'm, I'm happy with that. That's cool. Конечно, Tom is a very dangerous guy who can fight and fight and fight. Это очень опасный парень. Мы его воспринимаем на все сто процентов. Тут нет нет каких нибудь поблажек и так далее. Это будет полноценный бой. Yuko, how special is this day in your life? You came from a small city in Czech Republic, and now you are fighting, getting your title back in the most famous arena in the world. Since I started with the martial arts, that was on in my head, in my visualization, all the time. I just want to say thank you to all of the fans from Czech Republic. Let's go for that victory. All right, thank you guys all for the questions. We're going to clear the stage and uh, do some stare downs. Stay right with us. Fight week continues tomorrow. Ceremonial weigh-in the theater at Madison Square Garden. 